New backpack? Check. New pencils? Check. A start date? Well, in the Everett School District, that is once again a check. But there are still a lot of questions surrounding the school district's calendar for the year. Fox 15's Shira Matsuzawa joining us now with what's behind those questions and why there should be some answers soon enough. Shira. Well, it all stems from union negotiations, and it was only a few days ago when parents and students learned school starts on September 4th. And it might come to you as a surprise, or at least to some, but the union tells me this is actually one of the earlier agreements that they've reached. For the past two weeks, I've been calling calling, texting, and emailing the school district to find out what was happening with those negotiations and the school district calendar. Today, I finally got a hold of someone who updated me on that schedule, but we're still waiting for an official callback or statement from the district. But if you look at the Everett School District website, you'll find a note which says the entire calendar for the school year is still not out because it's part of the discussion in union negotiations and will likely be released in August. Well, today is August 23rd, so the, year, the month is almost over. I reached out to the president of the Everett Education Association, Jared Kink, who says talks started back in April and they've been bargaining to determine a contract for the upcoming years, but he says there are a lot of pieces in their contract that impact the calendar. For example, a scheduled conference could potentially impact a winter or Thanksgiving break, but he tells me they have reached a tentative agreement which they plan to ratify on August 28th. From there, he says the school board will need to ratify it as well. We're dealing with uh, several complex issues. Um, it's just not calendar, but it's working condition and class size and salary benefits leaves. I understand the community parents very much want a uh, calendar and details for organizing their their lives, not just around vacations, but uh, child care issues. Um, we very much understand that. Uh, my members, I serve about 1400 certificated members. They want to know too. They want to know the, the details. But what we don't want to do is give them details and then they make plans and then they have to change it. Now, you heard him mention child care. Everett School District parent Autumn Nash is a mom of three. She says planning out child care and trips without having a calendar is adding undue stress. Our kids wanted to go visit their grandparents or, you know, spend time with, like, family or plan vacations. And it's really hard to do that when you don't even know when your kid's starting school. Like, it's really frustrating. Like, I obviously want the teachers to do well in the negotiations and everything because I think teachers, like, are a really important job. But I just wish they could do this earlier in the year so we have more time to plan. The union says this contract they're negotiating is for the next three years. And they also say they appreciate the patience from the community. In the studio, Shira Matsuzawa, Fox 13 News.